So what's up guys welcome back to another video on the channel i know it's been a while and that's for a reason we have um been trying to figure out keyboard and mouse support on the ipad and um i think we found a solution so if you wanted to play these games minecraft among us roblox and any other game that has a joystick we have a solution for you and the d-pad a lot of people on the comments don't know what that is Basically, it's what Minecraft controls are, and it's really easy to just configure a Switch. So we're going to actually show you how to play Roblox and Among Us today on the iPad with a keyboard and mouse. So that's coming up right now. Huge special thanks to Chris, sir. He's been making this all possible. We're trying to get him to 1,000 subs, so link will be in the comments and the description down below. So go check him out. Give him some love, and uh, let's get right into the video. Okay guys, so it's been nearly 40 minutes as I've been working on this and I cannot figure it out. So Chris sir does it so much better than I did. So if you guys just want to go watch him, I'm totally okay with that. Go ahead and um, if not, stick around and I'm going to try and do my best at explaining this. So we're going to go into accessibility. Here, let me turn off my screen recording. Okay. So we're going to go into switch control. Yes, we're going to turn that off for now. We're going to go into just copy all these settings because once it does turn on, you will be able to press multiple keys at once. So hopefully you have this auto hide off, move repeat off, long press off, always tap for tap behavior, focus on the item, tap this first. And then just turn these two off, turn those two off, single. And yeah. Let's go ahead and go into Minecraft. Turn on switch control. And as you see, it says configured Minecraft recipe, which means that, here, let me go over here into settings. If you go into recipes, launch recipe, you're gonna wanna hit Minecraft. So that's, that's how it's gonna work. Now, I cannot configure the spacebar as of right now. Curvesur explains it much better than I do, so go check him out. I'm not going to go ahead and steal his spotlight. And um, as we load in here, you should be able to see the bottom. Like, look at the bottom. You see how it's just moving? So, oh, I'm stuck in a cave. I forgot about that, so um, sorry about that. But, like, look at this. I can actually move around and everything and tap all my buttons. Uh-oh. Wrong button, though. Of course it crashed but i could tap all my buttons with those settings so if you already do have it configured you're going to want to not configure them you're going to want to apply these settings and then configure it that's how it's going to work that's how it worked for me and um yeah everything's working but um hopefully we can continue to have this to work and I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but I just been trying so long and I can't seem to get it. He does a much better job at explaining it than I do. So the link will be in the description and comments. So go check him out, please. And it mean a lot. And hopefully you guys, we don't have hate among each other because um, there's been a lot of uh, heat in the chat lately because um, we can't figure this problem out. So just bear with us. We're trying to do the same thing here trying to figure it out as much as you guys are so thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video